Hey guys, so Patsy Palmer, she was on GMB this morning and she abruptly terminated an interview when she was only really a few seconds into it. Here is the clip coming up. Now she was objecting to what they had written about her on the screen underneath her headshot. She didn't like that, so she terminated the interview. But if you ask me, I get the impression that she didn't want to do the interview at all because she seems very reluctant to talk. Uh, there's long silences long before she terminates it. But here's the clip. Have a watch. Pain too much. It's like wow. the telly. Too much coffee, not enough sleep. <laughs> uh, her infamous cries of Ricky. I didn't say that no, right. No, you didn't. Do no. it again. I can't. Come on. I can't. Only Patsy Palmer can do this. I've been remembered ever since her iconic role as mouthy Bianca Jackson on EastEnders. Uh, since then, Patsy, <clears throat> excuse me, has traded the grey streets of Albert Square for the sandy beaches of Malibu in California. And she joins us now this morning with your dog, Boo. Morning, Patsy. Morning. Lovely to see you this morning. Did you move to Malibu to get away from people shouting Ricky at you in the street? Uh, not really. <laughs> Not just for that reason, maybe one of them, maybe <laughs> many. <laughs> well, Patsy, do you know what? The, you kind of have done what Meghan and Harry did, which is get away from the UK, go up, go off to California, set up a new life. And I know you've spoken about yeah. uh, Meghan and Harry well, as well. You've spoken out about them. I wonder whether you do get more privacy over there. Uh, yeah, I think you do. You do. You know what, actually, I'm not, I don't even want to do this interview because I don't even want to look at what it says at the bottom of that screen. So I'm just going to switch off, do a real Piers Morgan and just say it's not okay to have addict to wellness guru on the bottom of the screen. Well, I'm you know, huge my apologies for that. My issues that I had years ago that were talked about by me many, many years ago, right. and it's over. So I'm so I'm sorry about that, Patsy. A huge sorry, apologies. We didn't, we, really that, that was, it wasn't our intention to upset you. Uh, ah. That's obviously a quote from Patsy's book, and as she's talked about in the past, um, certainly wasn't our intention to upset Patsy. We were keen no, to No, I had no idea her, that, was, that was on the screen. Um, her wellness brand, which she's promoting as well. Well, that's a terrible shame. Um, our apologies to Patsy. Um, and uh, yeah, well, she's entitled not to do the interview and uh, we carry on. Now, I did think their line of questioning was a bit perfunctionary to start off with, like asking her, do you get tired of people shouting Ricky at you in the street? Uh, that was quite a few years ago, that EastEnders storyline. And then asking her, did you go to Malibu to escape from all the attention, like Harry and Meghan? You know, no offence to Patsy Palmer, but I don't think she's on the same level as fame as Harry and Meghan. And the reason why she's probably not bothered in Malibu is because no one knows who she is, surely. She's not a star in America, so those are lame questions, man. But do you think she was right to address what was written underneath her, that she was once an addict and is now a wellness guru? Should she have shut the interview down, if that's true? I think, you know, probably would have done her better just to stay on to publicize whatever it is she wanted to publicize, but then, I guess it wasn't going to be. To me, it looked like she just didn't want to do the interview anyway. She looked tired and bored and probably just wanted to go back to bed, presuming she'd have to wake up early to do it. I don't know. But seeing as she mentioned Piers Morgan, let's put them side by side, because it was only a few, what, well, a few days ago, Piers Morgan walked out in fury, and then it's today that Patsy Palmer shut down her laptop in fury. So here are the both of them, side by side, for your viewing pleasure. Goodbye. I'm done with this. No, no, no. Sorry. No, I'm so no, sorry no, about that, no, Patsy. You know what, that's a huge apology. No, no, no. I'm, we didn't. We, that, that, sorry, was, it wasn't our intention to upset you. Diabolical behaviour. Uh, that's obviously a quote from.